I think that uh, Israel, the, the government, and the opposition as well, I think both declared many times that for a peace settlement, we will be ready to give territories. And I'm sure that for peace, we'll be ready to give. But I think that unless it's going to be peace, we have to be stubborn and firm. And I think that what is really more important than everything is our existence. But as I said before, for peace, we are ready, ready no doubt, to give land. No doubt about that. Well, is that the position of your party, the opposition party? I think as about Sinai, that is the position of the government and the opposition. That for a real peace with all its aspects, Israel is ready to give back part of Sinai, maybe the major part of Sinai. What about the West Bank and Jordan? Now you say that the next step ought to be uh, some settlement with Egypt, I mean, angling towards Egypt. Uh, the feeling that some people have is that maybe some kind of settlement with Jordan might be the next step. That might prove uh, to be some impetus to peace there. I don't see any possibility to discuss with Jordan the future of the West Bank. The West Bank is part of Israel, and we must keep this part as part of Israel because of the security or the importance or the vital importance of this power to security of Israel.